Hey guys, Tech Made Easy, and thank you so much for clicking on our video. Well, you know, none of us like to hear the word divorce. You know, that means it's over. I'm moving on. But maybe that won't happen, hopefully, with Tough Built and Lowe's. Look, there are many fans, as you can see from the images I'm showing you. They are buying this stuff by the boatload. But these next images tell a different story as many Lowe's stores are deciding not to carry Tough Built, and they are blowing the stuff out. I mean, dirt cheap. And we were in Maryland recently, and we got some really good deals. But a lot of fans, a really good product. What's going on here? Well, let's go ahead and get this party started. So let's take a moment and talk about when the relationship started, really with Stack Tech, right? Because uh, Tough Built was in Lowe's, to my knowledge, for a little while. But when Stack Tech launched on October 19th of 2023, I mean, really, we are talking a couple of months now. It is March of 2024 when I make this video, but things are changing for sure. So we're five months into the relationship, right? The ring is on the finger. Stack tech is on the shelves. And at this time, it just doesn't seem to be true love. You know, it's a different love. It's not the love you have for your brother, but it's not the love you have for your wife or your partner, at least from what I'm seeing and from what a few others have spoken about as well. Is the relationship over? Well, not right now. You know, Steve and I both traveled up and down the East Coast, hitting over 35 stores to find hard-to-find items. Now, why? Why can't we just order it and get it shipped to us? Well, Lowe's inventory, right? Their inventory isn't accurate. You can check their inventory online, and it'll say you have zero. But then when you walk in a store and you look up, you'll see that the items are on the shelves. Um, the website says zero, but yet you look up, up all the way, as you can see from this image we're showing you, and they've got a lot, a lot of stock. Now, I'll tell you, I've spoken to a few Lowe's associates also, and most of them at the closeout stores say the stuff is not selling. The prices are too high. Believe it or not, I had about two of them that actually compared the prices to the Craftsman toolboxes. I mean, I started to laugh inside, to be honest with you, because that's not even a close comparison, you know? Now, as you could see from the images I'm showing you on the screen, there are a bunch of stores closing out Stack Tech. You know, it seems like it, it, the individual stores can make their own decision from what I heard. So they don't make a joint decision across all of Lowe's stores. Now, Steve and I took a ride to hunt for some more deals just uh, the other day. We hit some stores in Maryland and boom, we hit the, jack the jackpot. <laughs> Let me show you what we got. Um, we got a rolling box. We got a toolbox. We've got three large organizers and a crate MSRP four hundred and seventy four ninety before tax. We paid a hundred and seventy out the door. We saved over three hundred and four dollars, and that didn't even include the tax. And here's the picture that we posted, um, so you could see it. But we saved some money. Now, from these pictures I'm showing you, you could see that there's plenty of love out there for Stack Tech. And this is just the tip of the iceberg. You know, I switched from DeWalt to Milwaukee not too long ago. Then we saw Stack Tech. And I wasn't sure I was going to switch. I was, I was close. But when I found a couple of deals, I had to. I was like, okay, so, you know, I'm going to take a hit on selling my old boxes, but I had to. And so I sent Pack out packing and sold all my Milwaukee boxes. Let me show you my collection now um, for a minute. It's still growing. And by the way, I can't wait for the spring and summer lineup to come out 
I sure hope they make it here with the way this relationship's going. I'll show you this a little later on. You got to see some of the items I am looking forward to, but let me show you my stuff for a moment. So as you can see, this is some of the stuff I have upstairs, you know, compact toolbox. I got the tote, which is very handy and stacked with pretty much a ton of our tools that I need and the three drawer and the single drawer, two of those. And then obviously the rolling toolbox there. And then, yeah, we've got the uh, two-in-one hand truck that converts, which is nice. Let me show you what I have downstairs. Downstairs is more about organization. You know, I've got a ton of low-profile organizers. I've got the large um, organizer. I've got the extra-large toolbox. And then I've got the large toolbox. And, uh, you know, the crate and some small organizers. So definitely helping me be organized. And I just, I'm a fan. So let me show you some items I'm excited about. As you can see from the left side, the advanced transporter is really cool. This thing just collapses right into your truck bed. They're coming out with a hand truck that actually has the stack tech base. So as you could see, you could put your items right on the base, a simple hand truck. So it shouldn't be as expensive as the two-in-one hand truck we recently reviewed. And then they're coming out with a tower light. So again, can't wait to see that. And uh, here's some more. So the compact vacuum, that's going to come out. Now here's where I really get excited too, the XL One Draw Toolbox and the rolling draw box. I mean, you don't even have to take your boxes off of one another. You just have these huge drawers. And by the way, there is way more to come. Let me show you. As you can see here, you got so many more items coming. The, you know, the XL4 drawer toolbox. They're coming out with uh, compact deep organizer. Uh, a couple more things. They're coming out with a box fan. And, uh, you know, again, more accessories, more lights. Uh, which is nice. Now, by the way, these are some videos we recently launched as we started buying and reviewing Stack Tech. I'll put these links in the video description so you can actually check those out. I'll also uh, put a link at the end of the video for one of our videos. But um, I'll tell you, really good stuff. Video's not over yet, but let me just tell you, if you're looking for good deals, check those top shelves. Walk up and down the aisles. As you can see, there's some tough built all the way at the top, just hidden and no one knows. And by the way, just because you see a price on the shelf doesn't mean it's accurate. So take an item over, have someone scan the price, you might find a good deal. But let's talk about this relationship for a minute. So... The question is, will love bloom or is some counseling needed? Well, as you can see on the left side, that uh, yellow shirt guy is tough built. And to the right is uh, that lady with the eyes closed. That's Lowe's, you know, talking about, I don't want to hear it right now. On the right side, you've got the counselor making notes, trying to make it work. Will the relationship work? I sure hope so. I've already sold my pack out. I sent my pack out packing. Um, so I hope it works out. All right. Well, I sure hope there isn't a divorce. I, I believe it's a quality product. There's a lot of fans out there. So we'll see if the relationship works. And I hope this video helped you in some way. You know, if it did, take a moment and give us a thumbs up. We'd really appreciate that. And by the way, if you want to follow us on social media, right up top, we've got our social media channels. We also have another YouTube channel on the right side for Tesla. We call it My Tesla Journey One, um, if you want to look us up and uh, subscribe. And on the right side on the bottom, I'm going to put a video there. If you'd like to watch that, go right ahead. On the left side on the bottom, we're going to put a round Tech Made Easy logo. I sure hope you click that and subscribe and become a member of the family. Well, thank you so much and have a great day.